I've got a home in the sky. I'm gonna tell this world goodbye. You see, I am gonna fly away. It wasn't Christian for a long time. We'll be caught up together. Live with Jesus Christ forever. He grew up kind of like in war evening. You see, I am gonna fly away. In that part of the world, once you become a Christian, you stay a Christian because the society that we grew up in, it's either you're a Christian or you're into something else. And if you're into something else, you better just do it well. I will be free, free one day. It's like growing up in an environment where there is war. It makes you stronger. I will be free. There are warriors in worry. Free one day. I have two photos that has myself in most some of the band members. On one of my birthday, I could send a couple of that to you. How many you need? I'm the one wearing the same thing with the girl. We met in, I think, 92. We actually now got really, really close when we got to Lagos. He committed me to the job, our uh, compassion band. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Everybody just spread out. Most of them, yeah, are major artists right now. We had a great bond. We understood ourselves in such a way that we know, I know what he will do. Who are you paying to? That is the question. May God give you grace to pay to the right person. And that is God. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, please pay to God. Because it saves you from stress. Father, we thank you for this word. Who will pay to you? Blessed be your name, O oh God. In Jesus' name. God bless you. I went to Lagos for a visit and that Sunday I went to a church and um, the, lead, the lead singer, the praise worship leader just left the church. So a friend of mine like, oh, somebody here told the pastor, I was okay, let him lead. And I, li I led that day. The pastor had to pull his own jacket and give it to me as a gift. And right from that day he said, why don't you start with us today? And I went for a visit and stayed in Lagos. <laughs> You know, there are preachers that are singers. There are singers that are preachers. I think it's gifted in both areas. Tengo corazón de pastor, no sé cómo se dice, decir esto, pero, pero también me, uh, soy cantante. Desde la iglesia, otra empresa, como una banda, me contrató como para hacer su lead uh, vocal. Entonces, vivía de esto, trabajaba de 8 a 5. Hacemos conciertos, hacemos backup, hacemos todo. Y por miércoles, viernes y domingo, sábado, estoy en la iglesia trabajando. Entonces, estaba viviendo de <laughs> las, dos, las dos cosas, sí. And it was one jingle I did for, I did it was for a cigarette company. Mm -hmm. And they called me to the place and it was good money. I mean, I'm going to pay me 60, that was about 60 euros now, you know. Yeah, one, yeah. I mean, in two hours I was going to drop the lines and, and when I was through, the money was so tempting, I, I sang it. I took the money and I went home crying. Oh Lord, I sang for cigarette company. <laughs> I was that religious, huh? And every time I had the jingle on radio, like, gosh! <laughs> but I needed the money then, but I couldn't, like, man. It took me, yeah, I never went back, but I, I never went back to do it. This was the last show I did before I left Nigeria. I knew. I had my visa already. <laughs> I had my visa then and I just did, that was the last show I did. Yeah, I got to Spain 2001. I became 30 2003, so I was 28 when I came to Spain, yeah.
This is Philip, the one you're going to talk to. Those people from that area, they act almost the same way, just, you know, they turn me on. They are go-getters. They don't give up easily. They just don't. Sometimes I say to him, I say, you've not changed a bit. <laughs> So once a warrior, always a warrior.